face, you're dying to cry your heart out. to our channel. I'm Rowan. I am so, so excited for today's video. Can you guys guess what it's about? Obviously, from the title, it says Hercules Collection Video, so that's why you clicked on this video. If you are a big Hercules fan and you think that this movie is so underrated in the Disney community, please give this video a big thumbs up. I absolutely adore this movie so, so much. So, Hercules, why do I love this movie so much? I get this question a lot, like, why Hercules? Why is it this movie that stands out amongst other ones? First of all, like I said, it's very underrated. This is the movie that I grew up with. I watched it over and over again when I was a young child. I learned all the songs. I know them by heart. I know some lines in the movie, if not the whole movie by heart. I love the animation. I just love the whole aspect of Greek mythology and how they like how they turned Greek mythology into a Disney movie is just awesome. I do have to say that I love Meg and Hercules. I love their relationship with each other. I love the fact that Meg is like this feisty person. Even though she is a feisty person and she is very, I guess, strong-willed, she does have a vulnerability about her. She tries to play it off that she's the tough you know, girl, and in the end, she does need saving as well. Fun fact, the Disney damsels, the name, our channel name, came from the movie Hercules. I remember the line in Hercules where she says, I'm a damsel, I'm a distress, I can handle this, have a nice day, so I was like, I'm a damsel, and I love that, so I was like, let's do Disney damsel. So I was Disney damsel in the beginning before Mina joined me, and now we're Disney damsels, and I love that. I love the fact that I can call all of you guys our damsel family, like, all because of this one movie like that's crazy I also do have to give Hades a big shout out I did get a question like that too like why do you like Hades so much he's very creepy yes he is very creepy but I think he just has like this humor about him that is very funny and I love the lines or like the things that he says sometimes because you know he's trying to be evil but I feel like he can't play it off that way like he tries so hard to be evil and to be honest with you he just comes out as pathetic and funny so that's why I love Hades so much. One of the lines that really sticks out to me is when him and Meg are having that conversation about Hercules. It's like right after um, Meg and Hercules like spent the whole day together and Hades comes and Meg basically saying like this one's different, he's honest and sweet. Hades goes, oh please and, and he, she's like, he would never do anything to hurt me and Hades goes he's a guy. How hilarious is that because he's right. He is a guy and guys kind of like mess up all the time so he was telling the truth. He's a guy like why are you saying this about him but I just thought that was so funny and then she goes on and says you can't beat him he has no weaknesses he's gonna and then he stops her and he's like I really think he does Meg he does which is you I Won't Say I'm In Love is one of my favorite songs. It's actually the favorite song that I love to sing. I just love the fact that Meg is trying to prove to these muses that she doesn't love him. And girl, you do. You love him. You just gotta let him in. And of course, I love Hercules. Like, how can you not? He is good looking. He's funny. I think he's so charming. I love the fact that he is trying to be strong, but he's really like this, just a softy, which I think is so funny with the contrast between Meg and Hercules. Anyway, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> this is a collection video. I have to show you guys my Hercules collection. I do think that I do have a very big Hercules collection, and I'm so excited to share with you guys what I've collected over the years from my favorite Disney movie. And I do have to thank a lot of you, a lot of my Disney friends, and a lot of my subscribers as well have sent me things having to do with this movie so you guys play a big part in this collection as well so thank you to everybody who has contributed to this Hercules obsession of mine so I'm going to start off with what I'm wearing I am wearing the Hercules cake worthy shirt I had my eye on this for the longest time and I finally got it on sale mind you it was Black Friday so this originally I think is like $38 because it's like 30 and then plus shipping I think is $8 but I got it for $25 which is 
I think great. So this is from Cakeworthy. I'm gonna put the link down below. I don't know if it's still available. Sometimes they sell it really quick. It has Hercules, Meg, Pegasus. I don't know if Phil's on here. No, he is not. It's just Meg, Hercules, and Pegasus, but it's like their picture all over the whole entire shirt, and I just love it so much. And then the ears on my head are from Glitter Crafting. I love this pair so much. I love the pink background. I love the way that Meg and Hercules look. They're made out of rhinestone, if you guys can believe. This is a close-up of the ears, so you have Meg over here looking all sassy and Hercules over here and they're in front of a pink background and then Juliana, who is the owner of Glitter Crafting, topped it off with a pink bow. Just so cute. Here is another pair of ears that is Hercules themed. This was actually one of my first pairs I asked uh, Juliana from Glitter Crafting to make and it has Hercules, I guess, outfit over here and then Meg's outfit over here. The detailing in, in it is just astounding. So pretty. This is another pair of ears that I own. I apologize, but I don't remember the shop that I got this from. You can see the silhouette of Meg and Hercules and then there's just purple and brown flowers in the middle. These are so beautiful. I got them from a shop on Instagram and I completely just forgot where I got them from, but I absolutely adore these because again, Hercules ears are very hard to come by. These are my favorites. You guys have seen me wearing these. Hand painted ears by Artsy Liz Flores. So Liz, if you're watching, you are so, so talented. Oh my goodness. So I asked her to draw a drawing of Hercules and Meg where he's giving her the rose or the flower, the white flower. I think this is also the same scene, yeah. And again, I adore these two so much because I think they complement each other so well. Like Meg brings the right amount of toughness and Hercules brings the right amount of love. I love the fact that he taught her that not all people are bad and that not all people can hurt you. I love it. And then I actually do have quite a bit of a collection going on back here that has to do with Hercules. There are some Hades things in there and there are Hercules things, but I didn't want to take them out of the board, so um, I will do that at the end of the video when I get to the pins. I will just pick up the camera and just show you guys what pins and Hercules goodness I have going on back there. I got this on Blu-ray. It has the Blu-ray, DVD, and digital copy. Of course I have to have this movie because it is one of my favorite Disney movies of all time. I'm going to show you guys some of the shirts that I have that are Hercules themed. So besides the cake where they shirt, I have three other items that are that you can wear. So I have two shirts that you guys have seen before from Stewart Avenue. The first one is this purple tee. It says, I'm a damsel, I'm in distress, I can handle this, have a nice day. And I love the purple color in this and I love that the wording is in gold. As well as that, I bought the Hercules version of this shirt from Stewart Avenue. Stewart Avenue, which says, I can go the distance, and it has a little symbol on the bottom to do with Hercules. Again, I really like this color. I love the colors that they use, like the light lavender purple and like the dark peachy red. Another article of clothing that has to do with Hercules that I own are the Hercules pajamas. So I actually got these in my Secret Santa box from Beth. Beth, thank you so, so much for that. I can hold up the shirt for you, but I'm actually wearing the pants, so I'm not gonna take those off. But I can show you the shirt. The shirt has Hercules and Pegasus and it says Disney Hercules on the bottom and I just think it's so comfortable. I've been wearing it all of winter break and like I said I can't show you the pants but I can tell you that it has like um, the the face of Hercules like on the uh, pottery like when they were making him and um, it's just like all over the pants so this is just one of the comfiest things that I own and it's Hercules themed so thank you so much Beth for giving that to me. I have a couple of Disney mugs that have to to do with Hercules. So the first one that I received was a gift from my friend Casey. So I got a little closer because these are going to be smaller items that I'm going to be showing you and I want you guys to see all of the glory. So this is a Hades mug and it's actually a mug that forms a picture in the back when there's hot liquid poured inside of it. So when you pour hot liquid, there's like fire that forms around him and I think it's just so cool. And then in the back it says Hades. This is actually a mug that I got from our good friend Casey. So Casey, thank you so much for thinking of me and for including something Hades themed in my box. Another Hades mug that I have that I also received from my very good friend Beth is this uh, Hercules Hades mug that was from my the Oh My Disney mug collection and it has Pain and Panic over here and then we have Hades over here. I love the color of this. It's very vibrant and then it says Hercules, Disney's Hercules. 
over here. And I just really like the color and the style of the mug and it's all blue on the inside. This one is so adorable. It has Hercules and Meg just looking all cute. And then we have a drawing of Phil and of Pegasus. And again, I really like the style of mug. It's very simple, but very uh, 90s-esque. Just such a beautiful mug. And then it's all white on the inside. We're gonna start now with the Funko. So when this Funko set came out, I was so excited. There's not a lot of Hercules merchandise out there. So when they came out with this Funko set, I knew I needed to have some of these pieces. So I'm gonna start off with Hercules and he's showing off his guns over here, Mr. Macho Man, and I love the detailing in this Funko. You can see like his medallion on his belt, he's wearing the skirt, he has the blue cape, he just looks so, so cute, and I love the way that they captured him as a Funko. And then of course with Hercules, I had to get Meg. She's looking all sassy, she's wearing orange sandals, her purple dress, purple eyeshadow. I love also the way that her hair is done, paying very good respects to this movie. Movie. They did such a wonderful job with these and of course you can't have Hercules without Phil I think they did a really good job in capturing him as well because he's always looked so moody and just brooding You could see his chest hairs on his chest. That is so funny and his little like goatee He is just perfectly Phil. I couldn't resist in getting baby Hercules as well I just think that he's also very well done. He has the medallion around his neck. He's holding a thunderbolt He's wearing a diaper. He looks so so cute. I'm missing Pegasus though. I'm missing baby Pegasus and I'm missing the big Pegasus where Hercules is riding him. And then last but not least, I have the villain of the movie who is Hades. Again, a very big Hades fan over here, so anything to do with Hades that is made, I jump on it. I like the way that he, like, his stance is, like how he has his fingers positioned. He's just perfectly Hades. I'm so excited about this next piece. So I think they came out with some Hercules figurines in Jim Shore. You guys know I'm a very big Jim Shore fan. They came out with Hercules figurines, but I don't know if they came out with a Meg one. They need to come out with a Meg one. They did come out with a Hercules one though, but it was between Hercules and Hades. And Hades had Hercules and Meg like on him. So I was like, I'll just get this one because it has all three of them together. This is just, wow. I am so in love with this. So it has Hades and you can even see like like, look at the detail. This kind of reminds me of Ursula in a bit because of the tentacles, but I guess this is just like the smoke that um, goes around him as he's walking. Etched on his outfit is Hercules and Meg when they're in that balcony scene together. And I just think that is so gorgeous. I love the fact that they incorporated the heroes in the movie on the villain. Like, I think that is just so cool. I just wanted to zoom in a little bit to show you guys the expression on his face and the way that his hair is. Like, they just did a fabulous job with that. And like I said, on his outfit, you see Meg and Hercules together. And I think this is the only weird part is that he has like tentacles going around him and he doesn't have tentacles. This is supposed to be the smoke that is around him, but I guess they couldn't really capture it in a way that would show you that it's smoke, so I guess they had to go with that, but this is just absolutely beautiful. I love it so, so much and I treasure it with all my heart. So now I'm gonna show you guys the art that I have that has to do with Hercules. So I've shared this a couple times on this channel. This is from my friend Elisa, who has a shop on Etsy. Again, I will link her down below. She has amazing prints of all of the Disney movies. This is actually one of her Copic drawings, so she draws them with Copic markers. This is actually the original piece. Um, I think she has a print of this, but this is the original piece that she drew. I think this is so beautiful. Elisa is one of my favorite artists in the, in the Disney community. So if you guys are looking for Disney art, definitely go check her out. This is another one of her pieces. It is Hades and Hercules. I think this is such a powerful scene because Hades is taking all of Hercules' power and he just looks so defeated. This is another one of Elisa's prints. This is not the original. This is her print. So, but again, it looks like the original. Yeah, I love this one so much. Again, because it has Hades in it. Hades is not very well known. And of course, because it has to do with the movie Hercules. So this was gifted to me by one of my good friends, Kelly. Kelly is actually a very good friend of Mina's. I was gonna say Yasmin <laughs> is a very good friend of Mina's. I don't even remember how, but like she messaged me and she was like, I wanna make you something. What do you want me to make you? I told her I adore Hercules and I told her that I love the scene when um, Meg tells Hercules people do crazy things when they're in love. And she took that scene and 
drew them. Like, how beautiful is this? I love this so much. I have this downstairs in my basement, in my Hercules little section. You guys will see it in a future video. I will show you guys how I display my stuff downstairs. And then it just has people do crazy things when you're in love written at the top. And I just think this is so beautiful. We'll put down Kelly's shop down below if you guys have any inquiries if you guys want any um disney paintings or she even takes like letters so i have one of sophie it says sophie like the letters of sophie and it's like monsters ink themed and i did it for her last birthday and kelly was the one that made them for me so she makes such amazing things. I definitely recommend you guys checking her out. She's a doll. Thank you so much, Kelly. I love this so, so much. And last but not least, I have this beautiful thing that Catherine made me for my birthday. And it says, people do crazy things when they're in love. Again, this is a very big line in the movie because Meg says it first to Hercules and then Hercules says it to her when he gives up his power. So, Oh my god, this movie's amazing. I'm gonna go watch it after this. If I get you guys to watch the movie after watching this video, I have done my job. So I'm definitely gonna go watch it after this. But anyway, this is like a shadow box. It has like the color, um, the flat, the colors of Meg. Dark purples, light purples, and then I really do love the fact that she put their silhouette up here. Hercules and Meg has hearts. It's just such a beautiful piece. I love it so much. Catherine, thank you so, so much. I love it. <laughs> so the next thing I'm gonna show you is from Creations by Haley. She's also another shop that does a lot of amazing Disney replicas from movies. So she replicated the medallion in Hercules and I jumped on it. I actually also have this as an ornament hanging up on my tree. And of course it's the Hercules medallion. I could not like resist. This is amazing, like the fact that she replicated the medallion from the movie. I uh, highly recommend that shop as well, she does amazing stuff. I've done a video on her things as well, maybe I'll link that down below and I'll also put the link to her shop down below, but uh, yeah, when I saw this, I knew I needed to have it. So here I have a necklace that is ear themed from Tiny Magic Kingdom, I've done a video about her as well. It has the Hercules medallion on one side of the ear and then just Hercules style that he has like on his shirt. This is such a cute necklace because it takes two of my favorite things. It takes ears and Hercules and it combines them and I love this so much. And I also have the Meg one. So we're almost nearing the end. I'm going to show you now my pins that I have that are Hercules themed. So the first one that I'm going to show you is from the Oh My Disney collection that Beth got me from my Secret Santa box. And you have Pegasus over here. You have Pain and Panic. You have Phil and then you have the actual movie cassette as a pin, which I think is just so cute. This is another pin that I got from Kate at over at Princess Mini, and it's of baby Hercules and baby Pegasus, and I just love this so, so much. They're so adorable. This is another pin that I received as a gift from Becca over at Disney Kitty. She messaged me and said that she had a pin that she thought I might like since she knows I love Hades. So you have Panic, and then when you open it up, there is Hades, holding up the poison bottle and then you have pain over here and it says 2018 trick or treat. I love this so, so much. Thank you so much, Becca. So this is the last thing I'm gonna show you guys that I'm actually gonna be holding up to the camera. It is of Hercules and Meg, and I got this as a gift from one of our subscribers, Michaela. It is of Hercules and Meg, and I just love the rendition that the pin maker made. This is just so beautiful. It's really, really big, the size of my palm, and I cannot wait to put it up with the rest of my Hercules pins. Thank you so much, Michaela. I love this so, so much. So this is just a little overview of my Hercules corner of my pin board. I'm gonna go through each pin and show you guys what they look like. Some of them are from small shops. So in this top corner over here, this is a Disney pin. It is of Meg and Hercules. I just bought it when I was in Disney World. This is actually a print that I got from Marissa's shop. I'm going to put her link down below. It is of Hercules and Meg. She has a lot of Disney couples in the style so definitely go check her out as well. Up here we have Meg and it says it's been a real slice in her hair. This is from the shop Magical Thunder Prize. I will link them down below as well. I don't think they make them anymore but they did do a Hercules collection. This is one from one of my subscribers. It says I'm kind of a big deal and it has Hercules on it. And then below him we have a little baby Hercules and he's flexing his muscles. These next two that are kind of like gold 
Golden is a Pegasus and Hercules, and these are from Box Lunch. This is another pin that is from a think I think it's like a Disney collection uh, mystery pin set, and it is of Hercules, and he is holding up his muscles again because that is just the theme with him. He likes to show off his muscles. Down below is where we start with our Hades pins. So this is a pin that I got from Yvette from Happily Ever Evie. It says All Tricks No Treat 2014, and it has Hades. Pain and Panic dressed as Hercules and Meg. This is another pin that I got either off a trade or I bought it. It is of Hades and he is sucking the life out of Pain and Panic because that's what he does. And then I also have this pin of Hades' mouth and it has a hidden Mickey on it. Um, it had Hades on it so I had to grab it. This is the same style as the Meg one you saw before from Magical Thunder Press. It says Whoa, is my hair out? This is also a Disney pin. It has Hades on it. It's probably from another set that I either traded or I got myself. This is from my good friend Ashley from Oh Bother Ears. She knows how much I love Hades. She sent me this pin that she had in her collection. It says, my favorite part of the game, sudden death. And then down here we have another pin of Hades. The Copic drawing of Hades that is from Elisa that I again will link down below. She's the one that also did the Hercules and Meg Copic drawing and it just has the villain himself, Hades himself. This is also another set in the Magical Thunder Press series of their Hercules and this is of Hercules and it says Wonder Boy on it. How cute is that? So I have Hercules, Meg, and Hades. So I hope that you guys enjoyed that. I really do hope that there are other people out there that love Hercules as much as I do. I really do appreciate this movie so much. It warms my heart knowing that there are people out there, either pin shop owners, artists, and painters. I'm just so, so happy that I am able to live in an, in an age where if Disney does not make as many merchandise for this for a certain movie that there are other shops out there that are willing to use their creative juices to remedy that. I want to thank everybody that either gifted me a Hercules item or made me a Hercules item or drew me something that has to do with Hercules. You guys are amazing and of course thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite item was in my collection. Let me know if you're also a big Hercules fan and why. Why do you love Hercules so much? Hercules is definitely one of the Disney movies that I wish was well known throughout Disney, but you never know. Hercules needs to be included in Disney parks. Like, I don't know why they're not. They should be. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will see you guys in the next video. Love you, love you, love you, and have a magical day. Bye bye. Point is, I love her. She don't love you. You're crazy. <laughs> She's nothing but a two-timing. Guys, I know I'm nuts. Like, I'm nuts. I know I am. It's okay. <laughs> I love the fact that I'm nuts, though, and that I could be myself in front of you guys. <laughs>